sitting uh, in a basement in a office made of cardboard boxes. So uh, this is this is incredible. Yeah, like I said. Uh, There'll be plenty of time for that after. <laughs> so, before we begin, again, I want to thank everyone. This is amazing. Um, this was more than I think we ever thought possible for, for this film. It started very small, and yeah. So, uh, before we jump right into uh, the main event, I just want to take a quick second to thank uh, a few people who uh, Without their help, this would never have been possible. And I'm going to think more after the film, but I want to single out a couple people uh, first. Uh, I want to thank Mike here for starring in the film. He uh, he took a chance on me um, starring in this. I barely knew him, and I uh, I came to him as just like some student guy with a script and a bunch of promises, and he was very skeptical. He had to go away and think about it, um, but he eventually agreed because that's what Mike does and what's awesome about him, if you know him. Um, I want to thank uh, Safira, who couldn't be here tonight, for being an uh, amazing inspiration. I want, and most of all, the most important person, that's why these guys are down here, I want to thank my partner in the film, Jordan. Yeah, uh, he's, you know, He was the production designer in the film. He built everything you'll see. The robot back there, he built. He built the rocket ship. He built the set. Everything in the set, everything. Um, and he built it all, uh, even with my help, which didn't destroy <laughs> it, surprisingly. Uh, yeah, so it's amazing. All the way through, he was always... Grumbling often. Gr grumbling often, but he sent me back to the drawing board a few times making me completely reverse the work I had spent days doing. But he was exactly right. And uh, this, this literally, this, we wouldn't be here, this film wouldn't be made. None of this would be possible whatsoever uh, without Jordan. So, yeah. So, yeah. so a couple other uh, remarks before we uh, move in. Um, so this film, uh, has actually been picked up for broadcast by Shaw. And uh, so after the premiere, starting on Thursday, it's going to be playing in Medicine Hat, Red Deer, and Lethbridge. Yes. So in case anyone's interested in watching it on the TV, uh, this Thursday through Saturday, it's going to be on Shaw Channel 10 here uh, at 7 and again at 10 for all three days. And uh, they'll, they'll be playing it more afterwards, um, as well. And uh, though we don't have the time yet, it's also going to be playing in Calgary and Edmonton. And the one other piece of, I guess, release news we have, um, it's very strange, so don't ask me how it came about. Um, we're still working out the details, so it's all dependent on that uh, going well, but... Uh, in the future here, um, so many hours might end up being broadcast on PBS in Guam. <laughs> I'm not joking. Cool. Yeah. So we're taking one small island nation at a time. Uh, yeah, we're gonna spin the globe and put our finger down for another one after this. Sci-fi conventions. The sci-fi conventions in Guam. Yeah. <laughs> All right, I think that's about it. So I, I really hope you guys enjoy it. It was, it was a lot of work. We spent literally every day for a year working on it. It was, it was exhausting. So I hope you, hope you all enjoy it. Thank you. Cheers. <laughs>